Hi viewers, it's me Color Pro, and welcome back to Tour de Sprash. This is the last race of week one uh, of Crash 180%, and uh, our partaker is Yoko Monio. Hello, hello. And uh, yeah, we had some difficulties, but here we are. And uh, yeah, so I'll, I'll give you the countdown, and you can then you can go when I tell you go. All right, sounds good to me. So three, two, one, and go. There All right, let's let's see how everything goes. I'm very uh, <laughs> interested to see how I play uh, this game fast. Yeah, it's gonna be interesting. It's a bit do zigzag. Yes. Oh wow! Okay. Nice. Nice. You know, speed tech. Yeah. Yeah, see, it's this one of those is... things that saves you like what a little time, but like that little time adds up over a run. So it really does. I'm gonna, I'm gonna play safe. I'm actually gonna grab a few extra lives I come across. <laughs> oh, nice, based. Uh... So yeah, we're joined with Derek G4 Video Five. Hola, misters. How's everybody's uh, day and night been treating them so far? No, it's like all over the place in terms of time for everyone. Yeah, I mean, woke up like two, one and a half hours ago. Two hours almost. Oh, I forgot to no, death it's, it's all good. <laughs> I forgot that's a thing you have to do in this game. I, I was about yeah. to run off the edge of the way in because I remembered. I'm like, wait, no, that, that'll, that'll take me back. It actually loses, like, since I, I wanted to test it out, actually. Uh, TL did that abuse and I didn't, and it, it loses like 15 seconds or so actually. In Crazy. the first level? Yeah. Damn. Wait, to, to death abuse or to not death abuse? Uh, to a death abuse saves 15, around 15 seconds, a little less, but still. Ah, okay. Yeah. Because it also like, you, you can choose to go on the bridge on the right side. And uh, so you can have less boxes fall on your head at the end, but he still loses time. Mm. Uh, well, nope. uh, that, that, that's a death, <laughs> I guess. <laughs> oh, wait, no, I'm at the beginning of the stage. That is not a death. I lied. Oh, yeah, you got the. Okay, you got the glitch. So sometimes, like, when you die, when you three mask for me, then when you get another mask, you, the mask is like flashing. I've never seen that before. Help! Oh, it stopped. Yeah, dude, that's awesome. <laughs> it stopped because your your invisibility stuff, you see, kind of. Ooh, like invisible mm. invincibility. I see. Yeah, I think that happens also in Crash Two. I'm pretty sure. Mm. So I still need to die. Then I need to keep that in mind. I think. Uh, what is it until first checkpoint? I want to say. Here's... Um, that's coaching. Yeah, I was about to say. <laughs> no, I don't know. Well, I'll, I'll learn one way or another. <laughs> if I am near a, a pit, then uh, next to a checkpoint, I will jump in the pit. Otherwise, I will just fucking take it. <laughs> There's just one problem with that plan. There's no not any more checkpoints. In this that's what's <laughs> fucking weird. I think it'll... Yeah, I... I figured that's how it worked i'm pretty sure it's you need to hit one checkpoint and then die mm -hmm. yeah that's right yeah getting back in the swing of things see now if i was playing on console this is generally the stage that my disc would crash the great gate what? Sorry. <laughs> I don't know if I could play this level, guys. <laughs> Crash gets really excited when he gets to our mask. He does. <laughs> he does. <laughs> yeah. I get excited when Cole is in this level. Oh, oh yes. Now, that's a death beast that I want to be. <laughs> See, I'm curious. Are there are there optimal checkpoints? Yes. Uh, to do that. Hmm. Nice. 
Yeah, like that one's right next to a pit, so I usually see people just immediately spin to get the crate. Um, yeah, that's right. Yeah. Then go off the edge just like that. But that's like the ideal yeah. scenario is you would get the ones which are closest to like a pit. Hmm. Yeah, usually, yeah. That's, or the quickest death, yeah, basically. I think it's also because pits don't have any sort of death animation. They're just really fast. Pretty much, yeah. Look, he knows. He knows his stuff. I'm in the pits now. Nah, that's crash yeah. too. But nice try. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, let's see if I somehow fuck up the boulder. And by that I mean fuck up my zigzags and stuff. Oh, nice. Oh, okay. <laughs> boulder skip. Nice. Yes. Yeah, so one thing with zigzag is sometimes you can lose momentum, and uh, yep. because sometimes you can accidentally zigzag while you're in the, on the ground and uh, and go kind of left to right, and then crash kind of stops the momentum, and you can it can fuck you off. Yep. I remember sometimes I would zigzag um, and and spin past these boulders. And they would, uh, what's it called? Uh, the boulders would just end up catching up, and I'd be like, how the fuck is this happening? Exactly. Because yeah. I think they start rubber, do they start rubber banding after a while? Because it feels like they do. Yeah, they do. Yeah. If you die a lot, yeah. Oh, that's good. That's like, um, in Spruno 3, how there's that easy and hard mode. Adapted difficulty is pretty fucking sick. Yeah. Especially in these games, because they're a bit older. True. Yeah, 1996. Like, I didn't even know this game had like any sort of adapted difficulty. I know the second game does because it'll give you uh, checkpoints and stuff like that if you keep dying. You can uh, get pity masks here as well, I'm pretty sure. Oh, that's true. Hmm. I completely forgot you get pity masks in this game too. I don't know if you also do get like a check, like a P checkpoint at some point. I never died that much, so I don't know. I feel like the only stages that I've really died that much in are like the, <laughs> of course, the, uh, what's it called? Um, High Road and Road to Rome. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> and in those stages, like the checkpoints are honestly like decently generous for what, like where they are. <laughs> oh, yeah. Plus, something I was using quite a bit, because I'm not as skilled, were the uh, bonus rounds. Because they are kind of like checkpoints as well. It is true. Did you just like go into a bonus round and just go off the cliff for uh, a um, See, you know, I, I could say yes to save face. Uh, realistically, no. I did genuinely try some of those bonus rounds, but I just <laughs> ended up failing right away. <laughs> I mean, to be fair, it's not the worst thing in the world if you want to get some For lives. the extra lives. <laughs> yeah, it's yeah. like, maybe it could be worse. Did you get the green gem? I haven't watched your... your... Have I got the green gem? I mean, Eric. In, in your um, I, I tried going for it, but I, like, right away, like, 15 seconds in, I kept dying in some way. Yeah. So I gave it, like, three shots, but I just ended up skipping out on that. Right. Like, even I if I got past the opening area, I wouldn't have gotten that when I got to the upper sections. Yeah. What if I got the green gem myself? That that's for skipping uh what is it, heavy machinery, right? How do you Yeah. Is it actually Ooh. faster to do that? I Castle machinery. Mm-hmm. Castle machinery, yeah. I figured it would be faster because you're skipping a pretty fucking long stage. I'm not gonna coach. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe it is a hello DL. Hello DL. How are you doing? I mean, I'm I'm gonna go for it. I'm doing pretty good. How about you? Yeah, dude. All good. He's gaming. Uh, spoilers, but um, even Gaz, he ended up getting the green gem. What do you mean, even Gaz? He's good at the game. Crash, crash, crash. Uh, <laughs> well, uh, well I, worded, <laughs> I, I, I worded it like that because he he's uh he said he's not very experienced. Yeah. So it's almost like he's kind of like a newer beginner type of player. Right, right. That's true. Yeah. 
Uh, it's not a knock on him, like as a person or anything. It's just, yeah, learner. But, but anyway, I mean, true. I mean, yeah, yeah he, he, he picked it up pretty quick. Yeah. And he's learned quite a bit with Spyro too, pretty fast. What we should say is even Pez got the cream, yeah. True. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> I don't know why. The green, right? Well, yeah, sure. Yeah, 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 we'll go with that. <laughs> <laughs> no, but um, it's like I just assume Pez is like uh, decent at the Crash games because he's yeah. been in a lot of these uh, Wumpa tournaments and stuff. Yeah. Yeah. So it's he's... like he's more experienced naturally. He's a little bit better in Crash than Spyro, but he's he's pretty uh, balanced out. Hmm. Very true. Also, yeah, if we'll Yoka beats Hazard's time, then, then he has to start speedrunning Crash. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Ooh, yeah. Dude, that'd be and awesome. do you have a timer on the side? Like, I don't know how long it's going to take me to finish. <laughs> yeah, yeah, we have a timer, yeah. I have a timer. You're 10 minutes in 10.38. By the way, Oh, that's world record pace. <laughs> Judging by your time, um... You're doing quite a good job, you might actually get the, the sub one hour. Ooh, maybe. If I got sub one hour, I'd be happy. Hell yeah. I think he will get sub one hour, unless he fucks up in my minutes or something. So I'm pretty confident with the first island. It, it's like it's like the second island where. The second and third island where I'm not as confident. Yeah, that makes sense. Oh, dude, this is giving me flashbacks, Yoga. Remember when we were doing the Insane Trilogy and, like, we were going through a Stormy Ascents relic? Oh, God, that was awful. <laughs> My cycles were fucked in that game. I couldn't do anything. <laughs> yeah, like, he was just instantly screwed when he got to certain parts. It was the weirdest Sounds fucking like thing. Sounds no, Whoa. I swear, yeah. some parts were actually, like, I, I, like, I could not fucking do it. It was awful. Weird. Yeah, I wonder if it's because of, like, restarting the level so many times. That's... Like, it just messes with things. Theory. Mm. I don't know what else that could have fucking cost that. Honestly, yeah. Yeah, it was be. super weird. I don't know if that was the best checkpoint, but it was near a pit, so... It's not, but uh, it's this probably the second best one. Very true. Oh. I think my nice spin try. gave me a little too much height. <laughs> yeah. There's the uh, little chanting noise there. Oh. I haven't heard about cha 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 in a long time. Holy shit. The last time it was yesterday, right? Wait, where oh we? Uh, no, it was whenever. <laughs> uh, <laughs> no, it wasn't yesterday. I, I wasn't here when 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 that was happening. Oh shit! It was, it was whenever Cola PB'd. So four days, a few ago? days ago. Yeah. Three days, four days. Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah. That, that's a long time for me. <laughs> Stop spinning on my jumps. Oh yeah, dude, the momentum of that. He's fucking him over, yeah. It's just an instinct thing. But it's a good thing. Like, if, yes. you, if you, uh, you know, like it prevents you to get killed by the spikes. Why does everyone do that jump like that? It's... I just, how I've always done it, it's comfortable. Yeah. <laughs> Why is he judging us? <laughs> Uh, because he no. is good at the game. <laughs> yeah, that's true. <laughs> it, we we probably should listen to however Cola does the jump. Actually, technically, there's no need to wait for the TNT if you just go immediately. Hmm. Yeah, I feel like that. Oh, that's awkward. Ooh. Yeah. Well, or you can do a sub jump if you're bold enough. You can do a sub jump underneath the spikes, but that's. That's kind of cringe stuff. Yeah. Yeah, I'm not into that kind of stuff. Yeah. That that kinky shit. 
I assume that would have been the best uh, checkpoint to die on. Oh, look, he's a he's a good observer. <laughs> hey, look. Hey, hey, look. Oh. How? I'll tell you how the spin went went out before the plan started to to go. Yeah. See now, I does, saw this, that coming. does the spin last longer in Crash Two and Three? No, it's just that uh, sometimes when you jump a spin, then the spin cancels or it it goes uh... off for the last time, yeah, like that. You see, when he's spinning here. Yeah. yeah. Okay, that's interesting. Yeah, like that. Like, spins less, less, I guess, during when he's done doing that. Yeah. Mm, okay. I didn't even that, realize that explains that's a lot. why you mentioned it. <laughs> <laughs> it actually makes a lot more sense, yeah. Because um, that was throwing me off a little bit um, during upstream with those fish flying out of water. Because oh. I was, like, mistiming. I was mistiming the midair spin. Oh, yeah, that's right. That's why the bats also get you sometimes in Lost City. Because of this shit. Oh, that's right. Yeah. yeah. That's the fucking stage. It's always the bats. That's probably why in, like, Insane Trilogy it feels, like, way easier to deal with the bats. It's because I don't think it, cause it doesn't have that issue anymore. It lasts for a longer time. No, it's more like uh, the hitbox of the bats are, are bigger as well. So it helps. Uh, I that. Im imposter. I don't play that imposter game. My last actually... Uh, same, actually. What's up? Yeah, wait, what? When did you last play it, uh, Yoga? Um, I played Insane actually last month. Uh, Ooh, the nice, trilogy. dude. Nice. It was for it was for charity. I asked people, "Hey, do you want me to play the OG game or do you want me to play Insane?" And everybody voted. Well, not everyone voted Insane. It was Wait, actually what? surprisingly close. Mm. Hell yeah. Charity wanted you to play Insane. Yeah. That's... <laughs> <laughs> oh, he did. He did. Because he's never played it, so he just wanted someone else to watch. <laughs> So, you know, I was thinking, we we're, were talking about this like a week ago. Like, imagine if Crash had fodder, and like every time you kill fodder, you get a mask. That would be like Spyro. It would just be, would be too OP, though. It seems OP. Yeah. 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 Oh, I saw that coming. Oh. <laughs> I did that jump, and I'm like, mm, well, that was a little weird. I mean, like. Crash 1 and 2 already shower you in lives and stuff anyways. I, I feel like it's, like, little... I'd be really fucking excessive at that point, too. Yeah. Pretty much. But it's like, still... for as difficult as Crash 1 is, like, it is very fucking lenient on giving you lives. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah, totally, yes. <laughs> nah, I don't know why you had to say it like that. Did something happen? You should check his actually yeah, now, now I'm getting flashbacks to Ripper Roo because I had some problems here. <laughs> <laughs> which which is crazy because I've watched Cola do... <laughs> well, but now that this sounds weird. Uh, I've seen Cola do Ripperoo <laughs> many times. Oh shit. Yeah. I underjumped. Oh, in Insane Trilogy, if you die, after the first time, if you die on Ripperoo, they only give you one mask. Ooh, that's messed up. They don't even give you masks uh, in for any of the bosses in Insane Trilogy. Yeah, but if you die on Ripperoo, they do give you one mask. So, ah, so. okay. Oh, look, he knows the strat. Nice. He knows the hey. big boy strats. Very nice. So, I don't know, the thing is, like, some Spyro players, like, you know, Charity Dan would struggle so much in Crash games. Mm -hmm. Even though they might be experienced with platformers in general. Alright, let's see how getting the gem works here. 
It works. <laughs> I don't know if I trust it working. And by that I mean me. <laughs> yeah, you got twisting off, so now you're gonna pop off. <laughs> yeah. Look, if I fuck up, I fuck up. If I'm gonna fuck up anywhere too, it's gonna be at the top. Yeah. Uh, hopefully. Hopefully. Yeah, hopefully, we, we, hopefully, <laughs> hopefully you don't fuck up, man. See, yeah, secretly, DL doesn't want you to beat his time. <laughs> I would, I would, I would like to, you know, if um, if he got a uh, better time than mine, because you know that would just prove that uh, that crash is easier than Spyro, and that would, nah, I don't know, it would be just good, you know. Yo, that, because... He knows about the secret uh, Akoku masters. Yeah, I think I found that when I was a kid. I don't know, I was just like fucking around once. <laughs> I found it. Sounds about right. F around and find out. That's what you gotta do. Correct. See, now get, seeing these platforms is reminding me of the fucking Stormy Ascent escapades. <laughs> yeah. That was, a, that was a crazy time. Oh, God, that was awful. Oh, I also forgot about this, because you still played Crash 2 and 3, I'm pretty sure, after that. I did, yeah. Like, you endured it, you know. I wanted to get all the achievements. That was, that was like, the whole point. I think it was because, what, you did it, and I was like, ah, oh, I'll fucking mm -hmm. do it. Yeah. If Eric can do it, so can I. Exactly. Yeah, exactly. Eric's like me. We, we like uh, achievement hunting, which is fun. Yes. But Which, you do um, it on PS on PlayStation, I guess. Yeah, mm -hmm. I tend to yeah, do it on does. PlayStation. Yeah. It's like I found my Crash Four disc and it's star staring at me now to <laughs> be completed. <laughs> you know, you can do something with the uh, Xbox to get like all these emulators on. Shit. You can play like everything. Nice, cool. Is trying to get me banned on Xbox. <laughs> yes, exactly. Is Break it your even console. possible? <laughs> yes. Is it impossible to get banned on Xbox? Yes. Uh, I would assume. <laughs> Ooh. Wow, that was awkward. Your buddy. Oh. <laughs> I don't oh, did not like how that was. <laughs> I could feel my asshole clenching with that jump. Well, these oh, jumps are easier geez. than in Insane Trilogy. In Insane, they're kind of hard. I'm playing this like a fucking bitch. I don't even care. Oh, nice one. <laughs> uh, Paid off. You know, you can still get that exclamation crate even, uh, even if you nice. fuck up the lizard. Oh, really? Can you, like, jump off the, like, uh, the rock on the side? Yeah, you just go zigzag a little bit, but it's pretty so. Damn. Hell yeah. The lizard. <laughs> now, if I had my memory card in, <laughs> that would have been a save. Hell of us. Yeah. Well, at least you, you got the green gem. That's the. Yeah, first try, too. Yeah. I got 27 lives too, so I'm I'm feeling much more confident that I won't game over. <laughs> I'm just gonna grab another one just to be safe. It's like obviously Yoga just got all the boxes in the previous level. I was like concerned because he left some boxes back there. I was like, no, what are you doing? <laughs> Oops. <laughs> Oops. I can Spyro me. three. What? <laughs> I've always loved these stages, especially the just the PS1 version. I don't know, just like the, the pitch darkness. I remember in Insane, they fucked up the lighting in this level uh, before the game came yeah. out, so they had to fix it. I, I don't even really like it as much in Insane, just because I, I just like it when it's just pure blackout. Oh, look at you going for big boy strats. 
it didn't work out, but <laughs> it's the one. <laughs> nice try, dude. How'd they mess up the lighting now? Uh, was... I guess it's just more realistic. I, I guess. Mm. Nah, but not this, not in the final okay. version. Like before the game came out, when they were showcasing mm -hmm. footage, like it was too, it was too light. Like everything yeah, was, was great. But it, it looked was... a lot like a, for for lack of a better description, like a generic Unity game. If like you can imagine what hmm. that looks like. Pretty much, yeah. <laughs> And they oh, fucked right. up also oh. the Lost City and Sans Twister as well. They had to fix it up. Yeah. Mm. Luckily dimension. with Insane, they, they did actually like take a lot of uh, feedback from people. Yeah. Um, otherwise, the game probably would have looked way worse than it came out. Yeah. Name only impersonation thereof. <laughs> <laughs> Nice. I don't get it. I didn't know that was an extra life, and I didn't care enough to go back and grab it. <laughs> yeah, don't grab it. Yeah, yeah, grab it. Come on, come on. Grab it, and the cock will start coming. Wait. Ooh, fun stage. Fuck Activision. Fuck Crab. Fuck Coco. Fuck Cortex. Danger. Nice, Yoko's hacking. Again, this level is easier. I feel like these levels are easier in this world. Instant. They are. Yeah. It's, the uh, rope is not as easy to get on, I feel. Yeah. Uh, also, the pill shaped hitbox is actually very detrimental in Insane here. Uh, you can slide off the rope when you're already like on it. Like, like that, but like it's. It's easier. worse, yeah. But yeah. also. I don't know, people uh, think that uh, Insane has good controls, but for Crash 1, like, um, Crash 1 OG controls better, I think, like, than Insane were. I prefer Insane just because this game has a little bit too heavy of a jump for my liking, but, like, it's fine other than that. Well, that and the fucking... I, I'm not a fan of the, the camera uh, shifting back when you're, like, when you jump forward and then you turn back, kind of like how I just did there. Oh, okay. adjust my oh yeah. Mm. Yeah, that, that can be a little awkward. Yeah, that makes sense. But other than that, like, this game controls pretty fucking well. It tastes decent. Yeah. There we go. They did fix that, obviously, in Crash 2, but, you know. Yeah, for sure. It doesn't feel that bad. Yeah, you can definitely come back to this game. Like, I, I don't think it controls bad. I never really understood why some people think this game controls bad. It just yeah. has a bit of heaviness to it, which I don't prefer, but it's not bad. They haven't played Croc if they think that. Yeah, well, that's the... Or, or Tomb Raider. Oh my god. Hey, keep going, Liz. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> nice. Sorry, I, it just reminded me when I heard of, of Tomb Raider because the, the the remastered trilogy came out and people finally got to play it and everybody realized like, wow, these games control like dog shit. And I'm yeah, like, yeah, exactly. They they control really bad. What did they think? <laughs> That's why whenever people are like, oh, dude, Tomb Raider was so good, I'm just like, I don't know, have you played Tomb Raider recently? I mean, it was it's it was some good games, but, like, you can't, you know, ignore the fact that the controls were shit. Yeah, yeah. it's like the only thing kind of holding it down, in my opinion. It's just the controls are shitty. Yeah. And when they introduced the vehicles, that was uh, something. I think the worst part is, like, Tank controls already kind of were fine at the time the Tomb Raider came out, but they wanted to go, like, above and beyond to make it cool, I guess. Yeah. <laughs> so it just ends up being this, like, weird fucking game that just controls even worse. Twenty-nine, thirteen. 
I'm like, what, probably like it. halfway through, a little under maybe? Halfway through, definitely. Yeah, you're, you're over, over halfway. I just know some of the stages can be a bit long on the last island. Uh, this one. Oh, nice. oh, oh, you're playing bold. <laughs> This is how I've always played this stage, because I know you can get away with, like, getting pushed, and then you can jump, like, ever so slightly. Yep. So, I, I've i always played, I guess, risky and bold, as you would say. Fuck. <laughs> <laughs> ah, the hitbox on uh, Dark Lizard right there, a little, a little rough, I must <laughs> say. <laughs> well, it's a shame you can't do, do this in uh, Anthem oh, Trilogy. Wrong button. Yeah, yeah, you can't. Can I even get past the first floor of Sunset Vista? This is where all the time loss comes in. <laughs> Lose like 10 minutes of time here. Oh. Huh. Cut myself. Huh. <laughs> I haven't lost 10 minutes of time in a long time. Holy shit. That brings me back. <laughs> oh, that was really awkward. Oh, that might have not looked as awkward as it was, but trust me, fuck it was. Hey, look yeah. at that. Oh, that was intentional death abuse, actually. Uh, little did you know. Um, huh. That way I don't have to think about it later. <laughs> sure, buddy. Uh, a little bit too late to commit it. But <laughs> <laughs> if you went immediately, but... Uh, I need to stop caring about extra lights. So 35 <laughs> is more than enough. I think I'm like still just paranoid, so I'm like, ah, if there's a couple extra lives along the way, I'll grab There's it. no way you're gonna lose 35 lives, like, I don't think so. I don't think so either, I'm just like, weirdly fucking scared that I'll fuck up. <laughs> <laughs> because of Eric's words, guys. Yeah, e Eric's like, shit, he put a curse on me. <laughs> See, look at this, this is where all the time loss is happening, so he, he fucking cursed me. See, I I need someone else with that three hour uh, time. For this. Oh my god! Wait, wait, hold on, hold on. Did you actually get a three hour time? Yeah, since I DNF'd, uh, Lopsa gave me three hours. Oh, as, okay. as oh that's true. I, I completely yeah. forgot you DNF'd. That was my idea at first. And he didn't like it, but then he came around to it. Oh, nice. Yeah. Yeah, I looked out. <laughs> I think I was at 140 when I game over. Yeah. Which I don't even think I told you, uh, Yoga. I game over, game over it on the last level <laughs> of the game. On the lab? Mm hmm. Yeah. If you said, like, the Great Hall, I would have been like, oh my God. <laughs> Could oh, you imagine yeah. how tragic that would be? <laughs> imagine he goes to zero lives, like, outside of lab, and then he dies accidentally in Great Hall. <laughs> oh my God. It'd be fucking funny, to be fair. <laughs> It'll be worth for the content. <laughs> oh, so you're just using me for views? Exactly. I'm glad you understand. <laughs> I'm glad you understand the, the type of relationship this is. Oh, I'm glad I grabbed that fucking Aku. <laughs> yes. When's the uh, Twin Sanity speedruns? I'm tired of these games. Jakub, Jakub. I, I, I hate Twin Sanity. <laughs> <laughs> nah, I mean, that's fair. Oh, I didn't know Al was in the call. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> I'll back him up, though. It's it's not as fun as you think. Games. I personally like Twin Sanity. It's got a lot of problems. Like, it's definitely an unfinished mess, but yeah. I still enjoy it for what it is. It's but like an alcoholic really father. Yeah. <laughs> so true. I feel like it would be a fun speed game to break, you know, with all the out of bounds stuff. Oh, absolutely! Speed oh. runs of the game are like fucking wild. And the eighty percent is like seven, seven minutes or something. Jesus! Oh damn! It's more broken as part two. Yeah, com comparing the. Uh actually intended way how long it would be definitely yes. see crash games are made better because in crash you can't fucking right. break the whole game like you can in spider 2 and 3 well i mean you know 
<laughs> There's still things like item duplication. True. True. Which is easier to pull off than a lot of the game breaking stuff in. Uh, gem duping in, uh... in Spar 3. <laughs> oh, yeah, for the extra 100 gems. Yeah. <laughs> well, if it does crash, then it would be worth it. Yeah. 100 extra oh, gems. Yeah, well, why that, not? yeah definitely. Yeah. <laughs> Doesn't the percentage keep going up in Crash also? Like, can't you get like an absurd upset, uh, percent because of uh, the, yeah. the item in... duplication? Yeah. I know it works in Crash 2 at least, but I never did it in Crash 3. Is it like 200% in Crash 2? Or mm. something like that? Something like that, yeah. Jesus. I don't understand how people enjoy optimizing a category like that. No offense to the people that like it, but it's just like, <laughs> not really playing the game. <laughs> yeah. It's weird. Come on, break it. How come Koala Kong isn't that big in Crash Bash? Good question. I'm glad they made him bigger in Insane Trilogy, gave him a big old muff. Yes. They nerfed him in Crash Bash. Except in that TAS that Joe linked oh, yeah. the other day. <laughs> that was awesome. Yeah, that was definitely buff for him. <laughs> the buff guy? He is the buff guy. Buff Steagle. <laughs> <laughs> That's you. <laughs> So that you game maybe, wrong. but isn't this hmm? like the one of the few bosses in this game that has RNG to it? Yeah, kind of. Specifically, how Koala Kong like moves, how he is right now. Yeah, it's random if he's gonna go all the way to the left, or if he's gonna go in the middle and stuff. Yeah, yeah the other Which bosses aren't really random. Yeah. Yeah, because he's just weird, because he can just go all the way to the fucking ends. Um, True. It just waste a ton of time. I remember seeing on my splits, like, four second time was on, on Koala Kong, so. It's like the worst part of the battle, too, <laughs> that he does that. Yeah. Uh, he's one of the few bosses in Crash, like, that he he actually moves differently than usual scripted way like in the rest of crash games at least for ps1 it's al almost every time the same way or at least in crash 2 too what about komodo the komodo brothers I, they're like the only other oh, battle yeah. i can think of that komodos are, like, are weird. you can rng manipulate komodo bros yeah, it's oh, faster okay. at the way, I think. Is In any percent, uh, like Pokemon. It saves decent time, yeah. You can, like, manipulate so the guy, so Mo uh, basically uh, optimally spins. So, like, you can, so he quits spinning at the right time and you can hit him quick into the draw. Interesting. I guess that makes sense because he's the only other battle that I can, like, immediately think of that might be RNG. Um, tiny tiger. Very true. I mean, that's true. can he be manipulated? Really? He can be manipulated into something. Nah, not really. Like, okay, that's sexual. Nah, no, I mean, he <laughs> could be manipulated, like you know, where to jump and stuff. Like he could jump diagonally or forward. Yeah. Oh yeah, you can kind of like. Well, isn't that the entire point of the battle? <laughs> to manipulate where he jumps? Uh, you can manipulate Cortex in Crash 3. The bombs. Like, the Ooh, bombs. Ooh, okay. So you it, can make him not fuck you over then. <laughs> if you stand, uh, like, depending on... He throws the bombs uh, depending on where you stand. So, ideally you would stand, like, back. Or back and... Mm. Yeah. He would throw more bombs. Yeah. But... Could destroy the bombs. I mean, mines. Yeah. Don't ask me how. Nice. Yeah, you can actually destroy the bombs uh, I mean, uh, 
with Aqua, with Aqua and Oka. Yeah, when they when they do the explosion, they actually destroy the bombs. Right. Very true. Is that like a, I guess like a thing you can only do in like phase two or something? Phase three. Oh, it's phase three. Okay. That's the best phase. Yes. Yeah, that's pretty much it from a boss so you can manipulate. I mean, in Crash Bash you can manipulate bosses, but that's different. <laughs> yeah, by dying three times to be easier. <laughs> nah, I mean, yes, that's for Oxide, but I mean, to be fair, also for the Komodos, Komodo yeah. The, the Komodo Bros. Specifically last phase, I think, Komodo Bros, right? Yeah. Mm hmm And uh, even 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 without that, like, you can also manipulate Berminator. Gary and told me that actually. Favorite boss. It, well, I was, it's funny. I was just thinking about that. I was <laughs> like, yeah, yeah, I could have used that during my run against Gary. <laughs> yeah, I that spent like the... twenty minutes on that boss, dude. That was the boss that more or less broke you. I feel. <laughs> it, it it broke me, and if I did better, it would have been closer at the end. Because I feel like I could have won if if that boss went well. Oof. Yeah. Are you that good in Crash Bash? You're rivaling Gary. Well, it, this was um about two years ago, probably at this point. So Gary uh -huh. has improved just naturally by playing the game more. Oh, okay. Yes. So, so I I feel like he definitely beat me. Yeah. And I remember I got lucky on a couple of uh like crystal and gem challenges. Yeah. How many Gary mods did he he do that race again? <laughs> uh, I, I I prefer not to remember. You know, it's just uh. I have no, no clue why you're going here, but. Shit. I always assumed you needed to hit that. Uh... <laughs> I've always assumed you oh. needed to hit it. Oh. Okay. <laughs> that, yeah, that's that is why I'm going there. Uh, I guess you don't have to hit it. <laughs> no. no. Well, good to be double sure. Yeah. Yes. That's a nice save, yeah. Well, man. Oh. <laughs> now, well, you know those jumps where you can feel you, like you're fuck, <laughs> where you're gonna feel you can feel that you're gonna fucking die, and that was one of those. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, uh, I wasn't expecting you to die at this level, but here you go. He needs to. You no, know? me uh, neither. <laughs> needs to skip the boxes, right? Skip the toilet. Yes. Hey, don't do that. Forty-two minutes. Yeah, doesn't, it, doesn't it activate these two crates right here? Am I insane? No, no you're insane. No, no, no. Trilogy. Oh no! <laughs> what the fuck does it activate then? The rest of the box. Oh! <laughs> this entire time, I thought it was like you had to hit one of those to be able to get to the end. <laughs> mm. <laughs> this is the first time to you know learn anything. Talk about ruined stages and insane. Oh look, you know the optimal death. <laughs> I'm gonna be honest, I did not know that one. Oh, okay. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna be real with you there. I did not know that you could get electrocuted, <laughs> and that was in fact faster. <laughs> yeah. Uh, well, now I know. Oh, shit. I assume that uh, touching that little pipe in front of me just cause electricity uh, animation to happen, which is faster than falling off. Yeah, yeah. Interesting. I love when, like, games just have these tiny fucking things that save time. Because <laughs> it adds up. It really does add up overall in, like, a... Like, how long yeah. is the PE or the... The, PE, the, the world record <laughs> for this game? Sub 40 minutes. Yeah, think of all that time that's just, like, optimized from, like... Zigzags, uh, proper cycles, death abuse, jumps, cycles. Yeah. yeah, like it's 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 so many tiny things that just like add up. It's kind of like how in in like Spyro, I guess for you know, yeah, I guess comparison. That's one thing you. The, this game is so technical because the sub jumps make it really technical. So what exactly are those jumps? Because I actually don't think I am aware. I probably do them without even knowing. You basically you spin off like a platform and you can jump. You can start the jump, and jump. Oh, one. okay. 
Yeah, I guess it's like the closest thing you can get to a slide jump this game. Yeah. It makes you allowed to do some really sick shit. Okay, like yeah, I in heard of that in Dress of Darkness and in, in uh, Temple Ruins you can go jump underneath the spikes, for example. So you don't have to wait for a cycle. Same for the native and great gate. That is very interesting. I think I've seen it in the great gate in particular. Mm -hmm. I can't remember the last time I've seen a, a full. No, oh, it's done in light sight and fumbling in the dark as well. It's kind of shit in those levels, but same. Yeah, that's fun though. Fumbling in the dark. That's the uh, that's the key stage, right? Yeah. Yes. I think that's the stage that I call the hardest in the series. Or not in the series, but in Crash 1, personally. Oh. The stage is fucking hard. Yeah, I don't think so. I mean, I think the hardest level is probably Sunset. Or Joseph of Darkness. Is this for, like, uh, context for speedrunning or casually? Casually. For me, I always thought... Maybe this is just because I played the game enough. Uh, Sunset Vista I don't really consider to be extremely hard. It's just incredibly fucking long. Yeah, fair enough. Mm. <laughs> See, Eric liked that one. <laughs> so, you know, in, there's a big fucking gap between 7th and 8th place in this game, in Kando. It's all, almost 2 minutes to the gap. Damn. Yeah. It's always those caps. Eighth place is one oh six and seventh is one oh four. There was even before uh like between ninth and eighth place, right? Or tenth and ninth. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, basically. I mean Just... I'm gonna be somewhere in the middle with one oh five that be somewhere in the middle. Hell yeah. Oh, he knows the pinset thing. Okay, the Pedro thing. Yeah, true. <laughs> mm -hmm. oh, fuck. Also, the lore is we call Kupro pinstripe because he looks like it. <laughs> Man, to sort of table. Oh, this is gonna be close. This is gonna be really fucking close. Oops. That was an accident. <laughs> no. <laughs> that looked so fucking intentional, which is really funny. <laughs> yeah, I got you, mate. Check uh... me. I think it was Fifth Valley. If Pedro, I mean, if Pizza was British, it would fit him well. Huh. Yeah. Why does he keep laughing at me? Does he look funny? There's a snot from your nose. Oh, like that one kid in Zelda Wind Waker. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It stays there forever and it's like disgusting. <laughs> Don't all those characters like reappear in other games too? Um, I think kind of like with an asterisk, like, like selectively. <laughs> hmm. The high road. Lives. Trust me, that two-second time loss there was necessary. Garion's seething right now. <laughs> no, I'd love to Take see it. Garion do Crash games. Besides Bash. I was going <laughs> to say, what about Crash Bash? <laughs> <laughs> no, I want to see him do a real Crash game. I guess you could crash watch the old ones, the old races. The uh, 20 Sanity. Do you think 
Twin Sanity would be the game he would gravitate towards. I feel like it would be. I don't know. It feels very Gary encoded, for lack of a better description. I feel like Tech Team Racing is more. Hell yeah. Yeah, or, or Tech uh, Team. Oh, yeah. <laughs> How the fuck do you even speedrun Tech Team Racing? There's some glitches and stuff, actually. Wait, you don't play it intentionally? It's beat in the world record. Hmm. Oh, shit. Honestly, that's probably for the best. It probably makes the game actually kind of fun. Well, there's co-op. That, that is fun. Tag Team Racing is such a weird fucking game. Like, it's... The, the overworld is, like, the best part of the game. <laughs> and the racing is just, like... Yeah, okay. So this exists, I guess. Happily Ever Faster is the best homo. And anyone who says otherwise should probably off themselves. No, sorry, that was a little bit too far. I'll, I'll, play, I'll play that. That was a bit extreme. <laughs> I'm sorry, I shouldn't have said that. Yes, uh, <laughs> I'm a little sensitive about it. I, I said that before and I got shit on for it. Oh. <laughs> oh it's like, whenever, whenever, whenever he says that, I, I think he's like physically getting shat on. <laughs> Yeah, someone... <laughs> Is, I'm glad that I'm not the only one who thinks that. <laughs> I'm not the only weirdo here. <laughs> Time for the best stage. Oh shit, it is. Hmm. I don't think he will get yeah, sub one hour. has the best music. So I took just the James bit. Aww. <laughs> Yeah, too much live collecting. Fuck! Yes. And that. Yep. I mean, 51, 28 right now. Would be doable. Or. Mm hmm. What else is there? Uh, Joseph of Darkness lights up. Rio, the lab. The lab. Yeah. There's some machinery not because it skips it. But... Yes. Just assume. 105, that... 106, something like that, I feel. It's yeah, it's still not bad. Good enough for me to not worry about the spider one kill. <clears throat> All my cycles are fucked here. Yep. I probably could have made uh, that. Stormy Ascent all over again. <laughs> <laughs> Except this time I can actually sit and wait. Because <laughs> <laughs> in Stormy Ascent I was trying to get the gold relic and I genuinely just had no fucking time. That's why this game is better than uh, it's in trilogy. Mm. Yep, the mm. cycles can actually make sense. <laughs> yeah, exactly. I and... swear, if you play Insane for too long, the cycles just start breaking. Yeah. Uh, Past the movement and shit. Yeah, not good. It does feel real nice to play. Uh. Imagine that the the fastest way, bro, is like to fucking do small jumps, like. That's the the best way to move in in in, in, in first one. Mm, Is it really? Yep. Yeah, small hops. That's the best fastest way. Do you gain like more speed by hopping? Is it basically the equivalent of spinning in this game? Kinda. Okay. All I know is that's bullshit. It's bullshit. You know what's bullshit? Those small jumps, they can't, uh, they don't allow you to jump further. Like, if you're doing fumbling in the dark, oh shit, that's just <laughs> pray. pray <laughs> you're at, fuck! You're shit. actually fumbling in the dark at that point. God, that was like, what, two jumps away from ending too? Yeah, repair it. Yeah, close. 
It's okay. It's okay. Sub one hour is still possible. Mm. Yeah, well. <laughs> Unfortunately. I have a dream. I was going to ask. Sir. Oh, what, what, what was the dream, Martin Luther King? Uh, and I'm going to refrain from saying that. I don't want to be put on this pedestal. What were you going to What were you going to say? No. <laughs> oh. <laughs> um, yeah, I was going to ask uh, about something with the community where you, know, you guys used to do, or you might still do, the time trials in the Insane Trilogy. Like mm. that was the thing. Um, did you guys ever do Crash Four time trials from It's About Time? No. Oh. So I, I want to see Cola sweat, uh, <laughs> like for 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 bye 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 you or something. Nah. Bye 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 you. Is, isn't that what it's called? No. Run it by you? Are you thinking of run it by you? Yeah, run it Wait, by you. Isn't isn't that like some? Oh, okay, never mind. I was thinking of some other. Bye bye blimps. Bye bye blimps. Yeah, I was like combining uh, stage names. Honestly, Bye 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 does kind of sound like a crash thing. Because <laughs> <laughs> it's like um, they're repeating like the same letter or whatever. Yeah. Uh -huh. Look, I'm not coming back to Crash 4 un unless I have to put a race. Oh. Uh, that I was the hate. saga. Hey, well, then let's race uh, Crash 4 then. <laughs> <laughs> I still hate that to like get all the relics. I want 100% the game, but like, God, the fucking... They should have just brought back running shoes instead yeah. of bringing back the godforsaken fucking or bringing back adding the fucking triple uh, spin. Yeah, the triple spin. It, it just feels like this weird fucking rhythm game, and it just it feels so awkward. Yeah. Oh, I, know, I mean, it's okay. I know where I got that name. Yeah. So real quick, uh, Yoga will know this. Uh, bye 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 you. That's uh, some LCDC. L oh god, now I'm just getting everything wrong. <laughs> LCD, LCD sound system. system. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> See, now I'm thinking ACDC. Like, just randomly, it's all these. The, the wires are like crossed. <laughs> and LSD. It, 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 it's, it's from the Crash 4 memeing. So now, just the insanity of even proposing Trilogy? time trails. <laughs> Trilogy. Yeah. I'm sorry, you said time trails. No, oh my. <laughs> <laughs> That's what happens when you have two hours of sleep. Oh, yeah. No, it was like four and a half. Yeah. It was like four and a half to five. <laughs> you know, that's that's not too bad. To be fair, though, I've been up all day with like five and a half hours of sleep, and it feels fucking awful. I cannot survive with this much sleep. <laughs> I, I'm much more awake now, to be fair, at least, but, like, fuck, dude, like, before I jumped into call, I was so tired for, like, no. two to three hours. I was like, at first I was like, oh, God, I need to get this shit started ASAP, because I need to sleep. I'm exhausted. But now it's, like, pretty chill. <laughs> I could probably be up another two hours. <laughs> hmm. By the way, I, I got all the, the relics in Crash 4, so there's literally no reason to go back. Uh, to improve those times. Yes, exactly. Uh, yeah, no thanks. <laughs> yeah. I, I think as somebody who, I don't know how much uh, Dark Lizard has played Crash 4, but I'm just I'm just thinking of it, I'm just like, nah, that sounds fucking awful. <laughs> he played less than you. I played uh... to like five levels in total. <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> That's why he's friends with guys. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> I remember I pre-ordered the game I wanted to play it in 2021 summer and I never back, got back to it and that's a good thing honestly yes. like my honest opinion is like it's really 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 fun if you go for everything besides the gems well there's the, the enhanced mod now but even that is kind of leafy Oh, the enhanced. Oh, <laughs> what what is this enhanced mod? I don't think I've ever heard of this. Um, I I don't know much about it either, but apparently, like they fix the game up a little bit. Um, or you know, the mod fixes the game up. Like it removes like bullshit crates and stuff. I think. Yeah, and, like, like 
Something I think like some of them can stay, but, like, the problem is it's, like, over half the stages in the whole fucking game have those bullshit traits, and then suddenly, you know, uh -huh. you're like, oh, that's kind of cute. They put a really, like, hidden crate here. It turns into Pretty a much. scavenger hunt. <laughs> <laughs> and you're like, oh, my God. Oh, now you can get the Cortex again. Ah, it's so over. I might as well just reset. <laughs> ah, Ron's dead. That's like something love sucks. <laughs> yeah, I keep meaning to mention the... Well, it's too late now because I, I don't think there's any more levels with them. Well, actually, no, there's one more. But uh, the camera thing, you know, those camera enemies. Lops always yeah. points those out. Because <laughs> they have weird hitboxes or something. Okay, we're over an hour now. The dream is dead official. Uh, nah, sub one hour is still possible. I I believe. <laughs> you gotta believe. I think it's realistic to say 105, 6, 106 maybe. Something like that. Yeah, getting that green gem would have helped me significantly. Yeah. <laughs> Just seeing all those lives. <laughs> <laughs> I thought you said, like, how you're not even, like, for the time save, but for the Not just for the wives. It's <laughs> uh, <laughs> really fucking no, funny. Actually, I didn't even die during uh, that, that level when I went through it. <laughs> yes, then. Oh, really? <laughs> yeah. Should have Garion mode it, then. Look at all the gems, or, or gems. <laughs> get all the boxes, get that gem. Exactly. Yeah, it probably would have been a bit more optimal, yeah. Oh, look at him. He knows the fast threat. <laughs> okay, I spoke to some... I, I fucked that one hard, but... <laughs> my heart was in the right spot. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Okay, 106, 107, yes. Uh, Probably what happens. This version of the boss yeah, is so much fucking better too. And Saints is, version is yeah. fucked. <laughs> Someone's hemorrhoids are acting up. Yeah, because it's fucked. <laughs> it's so easy to fucking die for whatever reason. Yes. Uh, Specifically right. on that last phase. It, it's just like the yeah. hitboxes for his arms are just like fucking stupid. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not taking a goddamn risk. You can't do that in, in this, like in, in a Saint Children, you can't do that. Uh, getting the platinum here was awful. Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> when the game came out. I'm very happy I just went for the golds <laughs> for the achievement. <laughs> yeah, the Platinums in this game are brutal and fucking insane. The real thing is the developer relic for Cortex Power is a brutal. Mm. Did you did get the uh, developers time? times? I did, yeah, for Crash 1. Did they list the devs for Crash in the Insane Trilogy, or are you talking about the OG game? Insane, Insane. I'm gonna say, I didn't know if they added. Could you imagine if they had, like, dev times for the OG game without, like, a timer? <laughs> like, for an <laughs> They're just like, yeah, this is just our time. You can trust yeah. us on it. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, yeah, it's for insane. For the Tunis, like, thing, uh, the relic. Like. I did not know there were dev times in Insane. It's interesting. Yeah. Well, in for Crash 1. Uh, I assume there would at least be for, like, Crash 2. Maybe. Three definitely crash two is like questionable. Uh, yeah, no, there are, and there's a you can f find it on the wiki or something. And I think they misspelled the time for Cortex Power because there's no way a developer got like that's such a good time. Um, yeah, but I wonder if like the lab is also fucked because you know how the lab is like beyond precise. Ah, uh, that one is fine. It's probably close to the actual fucking platinum. <laughs> yeah. That's true. Yorma was struggling with it, but... Ooh, big ups fake Lopsa. Hell yeah. <laughs> big ups that. I 
did forget to death these, so I guess I, I'm mildly okay with that. Yeah, not bad. Yeah. Still saving the time with this. If he finishes now without dying until the end, then 107, I feel like. Hey, 107? I'm, I'm proud of that, especially because I haven't touched this version of the game since last year, yeah. I believe. Nice. Yeah, that would be good. Touch it, come on. Alright, here you go. Wow, you could have went. Whoa. I, I'm playing extra safe because this is right at the end. Yeah. <clears throat> Shadows to, really... to stick it when he was. He could not get the yellow jump here against the Versa in the WCC. <laughs> Ha, that was such a funny match. Such a funny match. <laughs> it's like, man. Poor Aver so had to deal with, with him. Oh, actually, 106. Shut the fuck up! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's this time right here, right? Uh, <laughs> nice, nice. If only. Actually, in the hand, yeah, but not the next. Do you have to take the uh, secret exit in Hundo? Yeah. Yeah. Makes sense. So if you don't fuck up Cortex 106, it's possible. Yet again, easier in this fucking version of the game. But that's <laughs> not Mr. Krabs. <laughs> this is the intern from, you know, the... I don't know why I wanted to say the salad room. That doesn't even make any sense. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I don't know why those words came to my head. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, 106.33. Okay, the calling. Nice. Ah, it might be extra glass. Yeah, it's gonna be less. GG, man. Time. GG. 106.28. Hell yeah. Ooh. It's pretty good. Pretty good, pretty good. GG. Where do I fare on the, uh, the leaderboards? Do you really want to know? I, I do, actually. Um, You're actually fourth. Fourth, solid place. Ooh, I'll take that. You beat Hell King yeah. Pez, you beat the big Gaz. And you beat the G4. Oh yeah. How close was I to, to third? Like six minutes. Oh, five minutes or so. oh, five minutes. So. so third didn't even get sub one hour. Interesting. Third was one oh oh fifty. Yeah. Well, overall, satisfied. Good run. Yeah. I don't know why I was so scared, but I was really scared. Definitely <laughs> didn't need as many lives as I did, but it's fine. Again, again, better safe than sorry. Yeah, of course. I have like 20 extra, but I'll live. Just making times here and then I'll show it off. Sure, sounds good. So 106, 28. 28. Oh yeah, don't forget to show your settings in the duck station settings. Oh yeah, I should probably do that real fast. Um, what is an easy way to do this? There is <laughs> no easy way. Easy way. <laughs> There's like no easy way to do this. Um, yes. Uh, I, I think I know how to do this. Hold on. <laughs> I mean, you don't have to worry about anything I do. <laughs> yep. I'm fully aware of that. <laughs> oh, perfect. All right, yeah, I got I got this sorted out. Perfect. Perfect. Or oh, man. That was good. LeBron, scream if you like Crash Bandicoot. No. Scream if you like Crash Bash. Yay. I don't know. Nice. Right, perfect. I showed my settings. It's not that bad, actually. <laughs> it wasn't that hard. <laughs> uh, nice. I mean, he looked 
Hello. I did get, uh, by the way, the USA versions of, of Bash, CTR, and Crash 3. Ooh, nice. So, from Illinois. Ooh, I get the CTR on my console, too. Nice. Yeah, that's gonna be fun. The CTR one is gonna be fun. You're actually pretty good at CTR. One of the better ones, probably. So it's, it's been a be while, fun. but I it's one of those games where I feel like once I, I kind of readjust, I, I feel mm. pretty confident, pretty good at playing. That's good. Sorry, I'll show, it, I'll show the people this time, if they deserve to see. Alright, people. These are the standings. So Koala Pro 4908, Dark Blizzard 5848. That doesn't sound right, does it? 58 oh, no, 58 some I don't know. I do, I know we were eight minutes apart. Ah it's fine. No. Uh, that's what I saw from the video. Um the results Oh yeah, 5808, that's right. Yes. Oh four nine oh eight? Uh, yeah, then then 4908, then Rob the Gamer 10050, Yoga Moryu now 10628, one fourth, Big Ass fifth 11224. No, that doesn't seem right actually. Best that's best this time. Big Ass is uh, best was 11525, yeah. 12424 and yeah. Uh, Big Ass is 15525, yeah. A little bit, uh, yeah, there we go. And then G4, three hours. Uh, default time. MVP played the game for three hours straight. Yeah. <laughs> exactly. I had extra fun with it and refused to finish. Exactly. So funnily enough, this will... Uh, I actually did actually spoil my time for Spyro, but this is supposed to go up before the Spyro 1 stuff, so... Oh well. Um, Are we gonna edit it out? Yes. Just do YouTube poop kind of stuff. Of course. But yeah, that's that was it for Crash One. Um yeah, that was it for Crash One and Week One. So next time you're gonna see uh Spider One. I'm pretty sure Big S did his uh, run first. So that's gonna be the next video probably. At least after the main announcement video. Alright. Catch you everyone later. So bye bye.